Hello, Gong Hai Fa Choi. That is how we say Happy New Year for Chinese New Year, also known as the Lunar New Year, and it's celebrated throughout parts of Asia. For our story time today, I am going to read this book. And first I want to say that you'll notice the book is red, and my shirt is red, which is kind of cool. It happens to be red, and red is the color of joy and celebration for China. This book is called Chinese New Year Wishes by Jillian Lin. And it is about a little boy named Hong, who is going to help his family get ready to celebrate the Chinese New Year. Hi, I am Hong. This is my favorite time of the year. My whole family celebrates. It is Chinese New Year. And what you'll notice about this book, which is really kind of cool, is it also has the Chinese characters that people write with in Chinese. So that's pretty neat to see those beautiful characters there. The house has to be spotless, very clean. We clean from top to bottom. I hang up red and gold decorations. It will give us good luck next year. So there's Hong doing a lot of work. Grandpa takes me to the temple. We pray for peace and happiness. I shake a box of bamboo sticks. It tells me I will be lucky next year. There's Hong and his grandpa. Tomorrow is Chinese New Year. Our family gets together for dinner. The table is full of yummy food. I love the noodles and the dumplings. It is the first day of the new year. I wear new clothes and shoes. My parents give me a red packet. With the money, I can buy a toy car. This is a tradition to give the little children a red packet, which you'll see in the next couple pictures. We watch the Chinese New Year's parade. A huge red dragon is dancing. The booming drums make lots of noise. Happy Chinese New Year. So this is the story of Chinese New Year. Long ago lived a monster called Nian. He stayed on a mountain. Each winter he got hungry. He ran down to steal people's food. There he is. People were scared of the monster. They hid away in their houses. One day an old man came. I am not afraid of Nihan, he said. He stuck red paper on doors. He lit lanterns everywhere. He made loud noises. Copy what I do, he said to the other people. Neon came and heard the noises. Help, he screamed and ran away. Each New Year people did the same and no one has seen Neon ever since. To wish someone happy Chinese New Year, you say gung hai fa choi. And these are the red packets that the children get money in. The Chinese New Year holiday is a busy time. Altogether, people in China take three billion trips by bus, train, and air to visit their families. And that's a great picture of a family having Chinese New Year. Each Chinese year is named after one of 12 animals, the rat, the ox, the tiger, rabbit, dragon, snake, horse, goat, monkey, rooster, dog, and pig. And if you want to know what animal you is your year, you can have your mom or dad Google it for you. I happen to be born in the year of the ox. And guess what? This year is the year of the ox. So I am an ox. The day of the new year is called the Lantern Festival. Children carry lanterns and solve riddles. Here's a riddle for you. What belongs to you, but others use it more than you do? I'll give you a second to think about it. But it's your name. Your name, others use it more than you do. Happy New Year, everyone. Have a great celebration. Goodbye from all of us at the zoo and have a wonderful day.